Hi Sagittarius, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your reading now for February 26th through March 4th. This is generally my readings are love readings, but the last few readings haven't been. So we will see what comes up. This is a weekly reading. What I'd like you to do is just take what resonates and leave the rest. Keep in mind that this reading may not be for you at all. If you are in a happily ever after relationship, it probably isn't. This is for Sagittarius. I think you're being tested. You're being tested in some way, perhaps. Maybe you're making a plan to do something. Maybe you're making a plan to free yourself from something. Maybe there's some sort of uh, oh, breakup that's on your mind or split, okay? And this could be in any area of your life. Could be at work, could be at home, could be anywhere. Could There could be some kind of partnership that you are thinking about um, breaking away from. Because there's no there's no victory and success there. I feel like there's a lack of confidence, a lack of success. Like I, like I said, I mean, there's no, there's a lack of um, maybe there's a lack of respect. You could be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, you have it on both ends. I feel though you're as though you are looking for stability and security at this time. You may be really financed, <laughs> financed. Yeah financed you may be really focused on your finances you know trying to recover it feels though feels as though you are are working on your future plans okay you're planning for the future financially and maybe you're dealing with something that isn't serving you so you could be considering leaving one partnership or one union that isn't working out financially okay it looks like your your main focus however is being practical and um becoming stable and secure or building up your financial abundance in some way you're coming up with a plan for your financial future that's what it looks like to me although we do have love here So maybe there's some kind of uh, new new path unfolding in front of you that is more stable and secure. Wouldn't that be good? Yeah. I mean, because with that world card right next to that, that king of pentacles, it appears to me that there's something new that is around the corner that is very stable and secure and it's a it's like a new a new phase perhaps you haven't been in this phase for a while i see a major new beginning for you sagittarius and it looks stable and secure so congratulations i feel as though your skills haven't been used you know you haven't been able to show someone your skills you haven't been able to people show them how successful you can be and i feel as though this is i'm probably going to be more of another financial reading capricorns was as well i just I, I feel like you have a lot of skills that we weren't being used because somebody wasn't letting you and maybe you're thinking about leaving this whoever it was that wasn't letting you use your skills or maybe they finally decide to let you use them but i see that you have a lot of skills that are not being um used and i think that You know, there's some kind of Let me get some more cards. Hold on. Somebody, I feel like somebody wasn't appreciating you. Okay? You weren't they weren't appreciating what you had to offer. And, you know, that was causing you some, some depression. It was causing you some anguish and some sleepless nights. But I think it's over. I think the storm is over, Sagittarius. 
I think that things are going to start getting better for you. I do. I feel like, you know, and this looks really good. Not only is this about finances, but I think it's about love too. It really, I feel like you've been robbed. Like you've been robbed for a period of time. Could be the last three years. I don't know. It feels like you've been robbed. You've been cheated. You've been lied to. And it's it's caused perhaps from jealousy, you know. I feel like you, that somebody has been envious of you and I don't know what this is, but whatever it is, there's some kind of something's coming around in your favor and you are about to start a whole new phase, a whole new journey. And it could include love too. There could be an offer of romance in love. Okay. There really could be with this Knight of Cups and this Ace of Cups, but it's slow coming. It's like you've been waiting forever for this. And I think you've been waiting forever for both. And that's why the test came out first, because for the last, I'd say three years, you've been tested. You've been tested. Your strength, your stamina, your willpower, your your world, your everything has been tested. And I see that you've learned a huge, huge lesson. And now things are going to change in your favor. It appears to me that new offers are coming in and you are absolutely going to love it. So, wow. I cannot even believe it. Things have been unsuccessful because... You weren't being appreciated, but I think that's over. I do. I think that's over. I think that you are coming out of this dark period, this dark night of the soul period where you've been lied to and cheated and taken advantage of. And I feel like new offers are coming in and you are absolutely going to love it. It looks like it's very stable and secure and genuine. Oh, I can't even believe it. Um... Wow. And it's going to happen quickly. It is going to happen very quickly. You know, things are happening very fast. And I feel as though, you know, there's these new offers. And I think one of them could be romance and the other could be financial stability. And I know I'm repeating myself, but I know you need to hear it. Okay, because you've been through some struggles, Sagittarius. There has definitely been some struggles. And it's all about to change. Okay. I feel like you're releasing toxic energy is being released from your surroundings, okay? Something is, go is going away that was toxic. And congratulations. I am so happy for you. Oh, my God. It, it, you know, I feel like the time has come. The time has come. There's no need. I think that... This period of bitterness and loneliness and anger is going away. It is being released with this devil energy. It's being released. You've been tested and I think you've passed the test. Even though it's the hard way. And things are absolutely going to start happening. Financially, I feel like you guys have, have a fantastic potential to become a leader or start your own business or start a new job. I, I just feel like the focus comes back. The focus comes back and it comes back very strong and it comes back very quickly. I feel like you are about to let your creative um, aspirations shine, okay? And I feel as though... It's almost, and I was just thinking about the Aries reading, why this came up, I do not know. But this is like honorable, honorable. Like you guys are about to be honored for all your hard work, even if it's just by the universe. I feel like, I feel as though that you guys are about to be receiving because of your dedication. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, it's shedding the past. The past, the past toxic situation that you have been in is leaving you. It's leaving. And you're about to go through a major change. I think something is about to be revealed that changes your life. Okay? You guys are, are really having this, maybe it's even an epiphany that about a new business or about a new job or some new skill or something. There is some kind of awakening, epiphany that changes your life or a secret that is revealed that 
allows you to prosper in some way. We have this king and queen, queen of swords energy. They're both reversed. This is this these energies are very heavy. They're very heavy. I feel as though you've been treated unfairly. You have been. You've been treated unfa unfairly. You may have even been abused. Okay? Maybe you were dealing with someone who was only out to harm you, but I feel like they're about to get caught. Okay? Something is going to turn in your favor after this unfair treatment that you've been through. And it could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn that reveals this or helps you out. Or it could be a motherly figure. Or it could be a woman boss or a, a prominent woman in your life that changes everything. Okay, I do feel as though things are absolutely going to be more secure and that your devotion is going to pay off. You have been devoted and it's paying off. It is absolutely paying off. I feel like the old toxic situation that you have been in is starting to dissolve. It is going to dissolve. And I think you have somebody helping you, perhaps even somebody from the other side, because judgment is from somebody from the other side often. And it could be a mother, could be a grandmother, could be a woman from the other side. Could be somebody that's still here on this earthly plane that is trying to help you, that is going to help you regarding this unfair treatment that you've been treated unfairly. You have been. And I feel like you have some help. Somebody's going to come in and they may, you know, they kind of like help you head in the direction of your dreams and desire, desires because this is a visionary. And this is also you. I think you have these, these positive visions for the future and your ability to go down this new road now is, is very likely. Okay. Oh, wish fulfillment. Oh my God. You guys, everything is changing for the better. Everything is changing for the better. It's what you've been dreaming of. Whatever you've been dreaming for, of is finally going to happen. I see an increase of appreciation here. After you felt like you were on a dead end, I feel as though you were you hit you hit a roadblock, and you've hit many roadblocks along the right way, huh? You have. But that lesson's been learned now. It's over. I think that you're at a crossroads in your life. And now it's time to change direction, okay? The direction is about to change with this world card. I feel like you're letting go of this depressive state of mind that you've been in because something is changing and it's changing very quickly. I feel like you were dealing with somebody who is very flighty and now it's really time for you to focus. Maybe you had, maybe... And I'm not, I'm sorry. Maybe it was you that was flighty. And maybe, it, maybe it's time for you to refocus. Focus is needed. It's time to bring back this concentration in this organization to prevail. And I think that the time is now. I think that it's time for you to use your mind to prosper. And I think that your mind is about to be used. I really do. I feel like someone has been robbing you. And the secret is about to be revealed. They're about to be, it's, they're about to be removed from your life, okay? And then, you know, they, whoever this person is that you've been dealing with, they've been robbing you of structure. They've been keeping things disorganized. They've been almost thriving on your losses. You know, and I'm sorry to say that, but it's like you've had somebody who wasn't in your corner. And I think that they're being removed. And once they are removed, everything just like, whew, blossoms. This person was like a, a vampire, like a psychic vampire. I feel like there was somebody that was totally stealing your self-esteem, your self-confidence. Just they were putting you down. They were totally robbing you. I feel like they're that... Now is the time for you to really find that inner strength, to find that force within that has been put out, okay? I feel like somebody put out your flame, but it's time to relight it. And I 
I think that's what you're going to do. I feel that there's a lot of, there's an exciting new discovery that's opening up right in front of you that, that, uh, I'm trying to think of the word, this new opportunity that reignites the passion. And that's what it is. It's the reigniting. It's like, boom, like that, boom, things change just like that. And I think it's very exciting. I see an exciting new opportunity where your visions become reality. This is visions and this is visions. So, you know, and then we have the wish fulfillment under here. So I really feel that things are going to start to change for you in a very positive way. You could have an exciting new um, offer of love and an exciting new uh, path open up financially. Sagittarius, I just have to remind you that these the timing is fluid. This could have already happened. It could be happening this week or it could be happening in March because March keeps coming to my head. So this may be more of a March reading, but this is for February 26th through March 4th. But I see things changing for you in a positive way super fast in both arenas of your life. So hold on tight. I feel like somebody's somebody's um, lies, impulsiveness, inability to care, whoever was toxic in your life is, is totally being removed and your life is going to change drastically. I don't even know if I zoomed that in. If I didn't, I apologize. I didn't. No oh, well. one. That's the way it goes sometimes. Quiet your mind, beloved one, and listen to our gentle reassurance that everything has been taken care of. Did you hear me? Did you hear what I just said? Quiet your mind, beloved one, and listen to our gentle reassurance that everything has been taken care of. Stay in a quiet and receptive state without worrying about the exact nature of your desire's manifestation. A quiet mind and body hears us quickly and clearly. This is our request to you. Listen. They're working on it. They're working on it. The toxic period of time that you have been through is being removed with help from the universe, angels, God, whoever it is. It's being removed. Trust me. Relax. Be patient. Don't worry about it. It's happening. Your life is about to change, Sagittarius, for the better. In every arena. Smile and be happy. It's, it's, it's time. Talk to you later.